YouTubers, Menno here, and today I want to show you how you can add a favicon to your WordPress website. So that gets back into Google Chrome here, and this is a favicon which shows up by default on your uh, WordPress website. This is what it shows up on my website here because I'm running it locally with XAMPP, so it automatically picks up that favicon. Um, to add your favicon to your WordPress website, it's actually a plugin. So just go to your plugins on your menu and click on add new. And just go ahead and search for favicon rotator right there. Click on search plugins. And that's the one we need, favicon rotator. It's got five stars here. Just click on install now. Click on OK. And we install for you. And uh, just make sure you click on activate plugin. And we'll take you to the next page. To your back to your plugins, so here it is. Uh, just click on, go ahead and click on settings for the browse icon, which is the one that shows up in your browser. And here you got the touch icon, which shows up on um, touch devices like uh, like an iPad. So just go ahead and click on add icon and browse for file. Just choose your favicon, click on open, click on upload here. And this might seem a little off, but I, tr I tried this a couple of times, it's a bit buggy, so just close this screen off. And click again on Add Icon, and then click on the top tab on Media Library, and click on Show next to your favicon, and click on Add Browser Icon. Next for your Touch Icon, you can do the exact same thing, just go back to your Media Library here, and click on Show, and click on Set Touch Icon. Then make sure you save changes, obviously, to take effect. And uh, let's reload this page right here, and there it shows up. And that's that's uh, all the rest to it. So like if you like this video, subscribe if you want to subscribe and you want to see more future videos like this, because I want to be uh, doing a lot more about WordPress. And um, yeah, have a nice day.